my first ever ballet lesson, I think I was swinging on the, the bars. <laughs> I didn't really <laughs> dance much. I was just, you know, um, swinging around and having fun. And today's going to be a really uh, cool learning experience for me, teaching my first class with Rudy and Colin for the boys' day. I would love for them to really be able to um, feel the music and, and have fun. Because really that's what it's all about. My parents always had music on in the house, like Michael Jackson, MC Hammer and lots of, you know, different genres and they saw me and my brother just, you know, jumping off the couches and running around the lounge room. So, you know, after seeing that, they're like, oh, I guess we should put him in a class. It's always been in me and I've just always loved to move to music. I mean, even when my mother was pregnant, they used to put the headphones on the belly and I don't even know, maybe even before I was born I was dancing. <laughs> I saw an interview with Barishnikov. He got asked the question, you know, what would you do if you hadn't have started with ballet when you were little? And he said, oh, I would, I don't know, I, I probably would have been a, a bank manager or something like that. And he was an incredible, amazing world phenomenon. So you just don't know what's out there. And, and if you could be someone who inspires many people, and that's why I just think it is so important that we get the message out there to as many people as we can. got the job with the Australian Ballet Company and I was just like, wow, you know, this is one of my goals that I'm actually fulfilling. First year was scary and thrilling at the same time, but you just gotta love the journey that you're in. That constant wanting to be better and finding, you know, what your body is capable of and discovering yourself.